fortunate mother and daughter live on the, on the coast of Connemara. And they're both stuck in the, uh, in the circumstances, and each of them trying to survive. And then the daughter has maybe an opportunity to get out of that situation, and the mother kind of takes panics, makes, panics yeah. to survive, and for her own good, um, takes, you know, takes measures to stop that. But it is quite funny that he's able to have these crazy clowns um, with language that's so ridiculous and colorful, and yet you know these people at the same time. Because it's because the language is so rich yeah. and beautiful, and the humanity you can take, you get swept up. But also, sort of the dark, kind of wonderful comedy, um, and they're just like really four pretty strong actors. Not talking, about, you know, I mean. It's a great, we're a good team. And, yeah. And the whole unit, the whole four, the guys are terrific. But just the play itself, the language of the play, I mean, this is a kind of complexity of these characters, all four of the characters. Deeply flawed, but human mm -hmm. um, predicaments. And sort of a love to the way the play, the balance of the play. Um, you, you think, oh, poor that one, oh, no, poor that yeah. one, oh, that one's the mean one, no, that one's horrible, oh, that one's horrible. It goes back and forth between sort of who you have sympathy for and who you're cheering for. I always love the, the odd love story between whoever, and I think this is a, a very odd love story, and it's what, what I love so much about these two women is that they need each other, and they're so much alike to play uh, this kind of character uh, you know, with Sarah is so awesome and, uh, and, and educational and moving and